Nation, it is staying over the world here, and we're back with some more content, guys. Yes, the spark plugs are done and fixed. She is alive and she's running well, guys. Can't wait to show you guys what she's about to do now. But before we jump into it, guys, please drop a like and subscribe. And show the support to this channel, guys. But just a week ago, guys, I was losing to everybody repeatedly over some spark plugs. I lost to my buddies. He came down and we were running it. And he was beating me over and over and over and I was just scratching my head. If he's stuck and I'm stuck, this shouldn't be happening. But unfortunately guys, yes, spark plugs make the biggest difference in a race. So rule number one, never ever try to race like I did, ever. I tried pushing it even with bad spark plugs. Don't ever do it guys. You're not gonna get nowhere, especially in this car. This car does not respond or like to do anything when it's misfiring. And uh, he came down and we raced and we ran it a few times and it just, it wouldn't do anything. The car was irresponsive, it just wouldn't perform. And now that the spark plugs are in it, we're gonna see now how much of a beast she really is. And uh, we're gonna go get us some uh, Ws today. It's crazy again to think that this car is just stock. There's nothing done to it. This is why I really love this, this year and model of this car. It's just, you can't beat it. It's a straight line car, it's S197 body style. It's one of the light body styles. This car is just amazing and, and what it does. And this is probably gonna be the final few, few times you're gonna see it stock before I start modifying it and tampering with it. Because uh, yes guys, 662 horsepower is a lot, but it's just not enough. And um, I got a point to prove. So let's jump into it guys. All right guys, so I'm about to head over this meet up with some of my buddies real quick he's coming with his 50 then we got a charger scat pack I believe gonna want to do some rolls and some head-to-head -head battles so we're gonna see what they about but uh I'm excited guys I'm ready to see what she's gonna do I tell you now that her spark plugs are done and she's healthy again and she's running it's time to get some new tires because we all know spinning ain't winning and I need her to hook. Definitely need her to hook. So I'm probably gonna look up some uh, Mickey Thompson's at night or some Mickey Thompson streets. Some good drag radios. Definitely want this girl gripping. A whole lot better than she does now because these tires are just awful. But yeah, let's see where she stacks up. <laughs> So here he's got his 08 GT out. Things clean. All right, Pavius, what's what's the IG, my man? Uh, it's Pavius Harper One. Pavius Harper One, y'all go follow him, guys, and check him out, man. He's building up this 08 GT, and uh, it's crazy to think I just had this car, and now I'm in the, in the Shelby. You want to crank it up real quick? Yeah. Let's hear this bad boy. I know the other night she was screaming. Oh man. <laughs> it's on 265, 35, 020s. Wow. performance sticker you put on it <laughs> clever I like it yeah man that's crazy and 
this is a what? This is stick shift? Yeah. Wow, nice. Oh yeah, I was probably nothing but that's it. Heck yeah. Mind popping the hood? Oh yeah, they get they get dirty real quick. Got a BBK intake. So what's what's your plans going in with this uh, car next? Like what do you what do you plan to do on next? Right now I'm gonna uh, I got the BBK Power Plus 62 millimeter. Okay, coming in. Put that on uh, maybe the ninth. Then I got the uh, full performance intake. Metal nice. Plus. Throw that on there. Change out the uh, change out the fuel injection. Okay. I'm gonna focus more on the motor now because uh, I just gotta paint it. So. Right. Yeah, I'm uh, gonna redo the front end for the better trucks. Right. Uh, redo the lights. Those are stock lights or are they aftermarket? Uh, aftermarket. Aftermarket. It's uh, a little dirty right now, but. Uh, yeah, that's one thing about my uh. My 2005, the lights would get so dirty quick. Yeah. So, uh, I'm gonna go something different that nobody's done that I've seen in Mustang yet. Right. Like instead of going with the decals back with the GT, uh -huh. I'm gonna have the uh, red horse and Mustang on the side. Oh, that'd be but sick. It's gonna light sick. up. That'd be so, real sick. Yeah. Oh wow. You, you could even the get GT. the you could even get the door lights too that that uh yeah light down as well. Yes. What kind of numbers are you trying to make in it? Uh, I need to brand it, so, I mean, the good tens would be five, the nine, high nine. High nines. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna change the, uh, uh bad cover one, too. You have to pull the front end. Right. Uh, I do all my own work. Oh, so you, you yeah. basically build this yourself. Yeah, I recently just took this off. Had a coolant leak. Ah. Uh, I took the metal pole off. I fixed it pretty much. Right. I did, I did my eight pipe myself. I put my axle back on myself. Wow. Did my own brakes, my own oil change, everything. Yeah, I definitely a clean car, man. The SET tuner, real good tune. BBK intake, exhaust work, nice. You got it set up pretty good, man. How about headers? You don't have headers on it yet? No headers? Once you get the headers and cams, you'll be a full bolt on. <laughs> man that old sound it's just it's more deeper yeah. than the new uh coyotes and uh yeah. gt350 this this is a more of a deeper sound those, you never uh, go wrong man those um what is it uh slp light modes are like number two oh like yes one. yes like number two in the telling you you just need some hot rod cams in this bad guy yeah. oh my god <laughs> Yeah, she's a 5.8 liter. Wow. Uh -huh. Stock intake, the SVT stock uh, intake inside of her. Oh, you got this, uh, I like those. I'm just enjoying her right now, stock. I don't really need to do much to it yet. Yeah, man. Until I, I start like, playing with the bigger boys, you know? I love, hey, I'm, I'm gonna put it on my snap, man. <laughs> I got a friend, he got a GT500. He got a
I'll go follow him, guys. Paid weight underscore TJ underscore. It's a clean, clean charger, 392. Awesome runs. I appreciate y'all boys coming out. Payway. I'm gonna tell them to go follow you on the IG. What's the IG again? Payway underscore TJ underscore. Gotcha, gotcha. What's done in the car so far? It's just stock. <laughs> y'all go check him out, man. Y'all go check him out, man. He just battled the GT, man. Y'all go check him out, guys. We out. Yeah, I don't know. Real fun. Uh, what am I gonna do with you, Rosalina? What am I gonna do with you? I thought the spark plugs was the answer, guys, but she still feels, she just feels, I don't know. She's not performing, uh, she's not performing the way she should be. It's making like rattling sounds when I'm hitting the gas. I don't know. <laughs> but nah, it was fun. There was some good runs. And uh, y'all stay tuned, guys, to the build on both cars because he's got some coming, cooking up too on his GT. Yes, sir. All right, guys, we had to cut that early. Unfortunately, very fun battles, by the way. Bros went at it in a good, friendly head to head but uh i'm actually on the way right now to ford because rosalina is having some complications still and right now she is shaking and wants to basically stall out so i don't know what's going on with it she was performing a little bit better when i put those spark plugs in but that seems to not be the issue so we are going straight back to ford and we're gonna find out What's the deal with her? Why? 
exactly this way. I don't know what else could be the problem. Um, but she's not idling right and the car wants to stall out and the exhaust is revving high and 